Assalamu alaikum viewers. Welcome to my channel SK Electronics. I hope you all are fine. My today's topic is resistor color code. The number one question is why color code? Why do we need to learn color coding? To answer this question, let's have a look on the history. Earlier in 80s, commercially alloys of nichrome, manganese and contestant were used. But problem with resistors made of this material was that the resistivity is independent of temperature. What, what does that mean? The meaning of this sentence is that by increasing temperature, resistance of material also changes undesirably during an experiment. Of course, you don't want that the resistance of my circuit changes once current starts flowing now the question is why resistance changes and temperature increases during electricity it is obvious that temperature will increase because heat is produced when current starts flowing and if a low resistor used then my experimental setup will be changed giving me false results another limitation of alloys is that very high value resistors like 1 mega, 1 giga cannot be obtained if alloy resistors are used because cost becomes very very high and it is very impractical. After the limitations of alloys, carbon resistors came into existence which are graphite or amorphous carbon advantage of using carbon resistor is that very high resistance can be achieved secondly they are very small and compact in size limitation of resistivity is omitted here under high temperature its resistance does not change now the last point answers our question of why color code because the size of carbon resistor is very very small that the value of resistors can't be written on it that is why color bands are used to represent the value of resistor that is why we need to learn color codes there are four types of color bands number one three band resistor which looks like in the figure then and there are three colors in four band resistor there are four bands in five band we have five bands in six band you see here six bands here you see a gap between some of the bands the gap here shows that the next band is tolerance band these bands are also called rings here we have temperature coefficient band and six band resistor now we will discuss carbon resistor band configuration in three band resistor we have one significant digit second significant digit and a multiplier band in four band resistor we have an additional band which is the tolerance band tolerance means how much error in the value of resistance can be in five band resistor we have three significant digit which is additional one multiplier and one tolerance band in six band resistor there is addition of temperature coefficient band what this band represent is that how much resistor value changes with change in temperature Our goal is to find the value of resistor by its colors. To do this, we need to have this chart. It is very easy to memorize. I have shown here two mnemonics. You can choose any one which you find easy for you. First mnemonic is BB Roy of Great Britain has very good wife. Second, black bananas really offend your girlfriend, but the violets gets welcomed. Four digits, just write numbers from 0 to 9 in each column. For multiplier, write 1 and multiply each time by 10. It's 10, 100, 1K, 10K, 100K and so on. For tolerance band, we have gold, silver and none. 
and third digit column is only for fifth and sixth band values for multiplier of gold silver is 0.1 and 0 0.01 and their tolerance values are 5 10 and 20 tolerance values for significant digits is in decreasing trend except the red which is 2 percent tolerance band values are 5 10 and 20 percent temperature coefficient uh, values are also in decreasing order except the yellow one which is 25 i suggest you you memorize the first mnemonic which is very easy bb roy of great britain has very good wife if you memorize mnemonic it is easy to uh, write colors in correct order for your exams now we have learned what is color coding and how to use it let us solve some examples to see whether we learned it correctly third band resistor is the first example first step is that we write the colors in the order as here in brown black and red first we look for brown in the table it is brown and first digit, digit is one so we write here one now we look for black and second digit it is zero and we write here is zero for multiplier and red red and multiplier it is 100 and we write it here value becomes 10 into 100 is equal to 1 kilo ohms now we have here a four band resistor let's write down the colors gray red orange and gold this is gold not yellow look for gray in the table and first digit it is 8 we write it here next red it is 2 we write here 2 multiplier for orange it is 1k we write it here in the table for gold tolerance is plus minus 5 percent so our value comes out to be 82k ohms plus minus 5%. Next we have 5 band resistor. First write the colors. Yellow, violet, green, red and brown. Look for yellow first digit. It is 4. For violet we have 7. For green third digit it is 5 red for multiplier it is 100 tolerance for brown color it is plus minus 1% so our value comes out to be 47,500 which is 47.5 kilo ohms plus minus 1% example is of six band resistor here we have additional temperature coefficient resistor colors are red violet blue black gold and brown tolerance band we have always gold color not yellow so don't get confused that it is a yellow color now look for red in the table it is two in the first digit look for violet second digit it, it is seven third digit blue is six black multiplier is into one gold tolerance we have known that it is plus minus five percent temperature coefficient for brown color it is hundred so our value comes out to be 276 ohms plus minus 5% also at 100 ppm which is a temperature coffee. I have given here some more examples which you can try by yourself and see whether you learned it correctly. So these are the six examples of four band resistor. These are five band resistor examples. And these are six band resistor examples. Try to do them yourself and comment your solutions to tally with others.